So we know now that policies are enforced in a top-down manner. And we know that the most specific policy should be placed at the top. But what happens when we have created multiple policies and we don't have the most specific policies at the top and therefore we have different groups of teams, whether that's departments or different parts of the organization, hitting policies that they shouldn't really be hitting. And because of the way that the policy structure is currently, they are not hitting the correct policy. Well, with Cisco Umbrella, this is fairly straightforward to arrange these policies. So you can see there we, we, we do have a notification or a, a little header there that says that the policies are sorted by order of enforcement. And, you know, if we want to change these around, we can simply drag and drop these. So you can see we can move them around however we want them, just like that. And in this example, we have our default policy, which can't be moved. This sits at the bottom, but our, let's say our finance department policy is more specific than the company wide policy. So it makes sense for the finance department policy to be above the company wide policy. So the company wide policy, let's say would be a policy that would apply to everybody and everything, every identity within the organization. But then we create more specific departmental policies and we want those to be towards the top so to do that we just simply move our company-wide policy down there just below the finance department but above the default policy because that can't be changed and now you can see we have more specific policies placed at the top so we've got the it admins which is going to be a policy just for the it administrators and then we have the finance department policy which will be applicable for the finance department as well so that's how we can easily move around our policies if we have multiple policies and want to move the more specific ones towards the top